Surging crime, inflation, record high gas prices, all sure to be discussed during New York's gubernatorial debate tonight. You can watch it live at 8 Eastern right here on Newsmax. It's the GOP debate. We want to head now to Rochester, New York, where we find the host of America Right Now, Tom Vasily. He's asking New Yorkers what concerns them the most heading into the primary elections next week. Hey, Tom, how's it going? It's going well. One week to go until voters head to the polls here in the Empire State. And I'm at Pixley's Restaurant outside of Rochester in advance of that 8 p.m. debate where those candidates will make their closing argument to the voters. And we've been talking to voters here all morning about the issues that are important to them as they head to the polls. Take a listen. Everybody I talk to knows somebody that's either moved out of the state because they can't afford it, They're thinking of moving out of the state, or they themselves are planning on moving. I mean, inflation is just out of control. Taxes are out of control. Crime, historic high. People are afraid, especially in our cities. There's no leadership. There's nobody addressing this. In New York, people are leaving New York in droves. The other thing that I'm concerned about is the increase in violence and crime in New York State, especially here in Monroe County. You know, mm -hmm. so the two-party system, or excuse me, the, there's no two-party system. It's the one-party system ruling, and we need two-party. We got some good candidates. We need to get them elected to change what's happening in our state right now. And uh, Kathy Ho Governor Kathy Hochul's uh, approval rating stands now at 41 percent. A lot of folks here in upstate New York remember another red wave year, 1994, and they're hoping that uh, they could elect a Republican governor even in deep blue New York. So tonight, again, uh, the four candidates hit the stage at 8 p.m., uh, and our own Eric Bowling will be moderating this final debate. Back to you. Hey, Tom, when you were talking to voters, were they excited about one of those candidates that you mentioned? Again, the four guys who will be joining the stage tonight answering questions. You know, it seems that Congressman Lee Zeldin appears to have a, a bit of a, a bit of an edge. Uh, but other voters that we talked to said, look, we're going to come out. We're going to vote for whoever we vote for. We just want to get to November. And regardless of who wins the primary, they know that they need a change here in New York. They're coming out to vote whoever wins the primary. Uh, le recent polling does show Zeldin has an edge. But more than 20 percent of the voters are still undecided with a week to go. All right. Tom Basile live talking to voters at the diner there, taking a little break right now. Appreciate it, Tom. Thanks so much. Again, if you are wanting to tune in to that New York gubernatorial debate, uh, we've got it for you tonight. Can a blue state be flipped red? How big a role will crime and woke district attorney policies play into that, into the state of the race? Tune in tonight, 8 p.m. Eastern. Eric Bowling's got you covered with hosting it. Stay tuned for that.